Hello my friends, welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to take a look at NCAA 2002 and they had this quarterback in this game named Rex Grossman who could flat out sling the football. But before we get into that, let's talk about this here game. Now this is the intro, you, you pop this thing in and you're like, oh my gosh, we finally have college football on the PS2. Next gen back then, NCAA 2002 was the first college football game on the PS2. Now you have to remember that NCAA 2001, it was not on the PlayStation 2, it was on the original PlayStation. So everybody was hyped because the graphics were like, oh my gosh, look at the upgrade. Oh my goodness gracious, do you see this? Look at these passes, look at everything. Now, of course, there's always some drawbacks for the first installment on a new or on a next gen console, right? So one of the things is that the gloves, a lot of guys didn't wear gloves, even though a lot of guys did wear gloves in college football at this point. Now the guys who are wearing gloves, their gloves are black. Why is that a problem? It's really not the biggest deal in the world, except for back then, college football players could only wear gray gloves. So that was a little bit of a draw black because draw back, excuse me, because in NCAA 2003 they did fix that. Madden 2002 they added a few equipment tweaks that NCAA 2002 did not get until NCAA 2003. We're talking about the mouthpiece. We're talking about the face mask that a guy like Marshall Falk wore, like a guy like Antonio Brown does wear. You also had that big QB face mask that Tony Gonzalez is a tight end he wore. That was in Madden 2002. Dante Culpepper he rocked that. That face mask as well and those face masks plus the mouth guard did not make it to NCAA 2002 so this is basically just Madden 2001 dressed in college football I wasn't complaining back then really not complaining back right now I'm just pointing out a fact that if you look the guys are still wearing elbow pads in Madden 2001 that was heavy but watch Rex Grossman do what Rex Grossman does oh baby did you see that pass big Rex out there slinging it he out there slinging it my goodness gracious, look at that pass by my boy Rex Grossman, though. He was a beast in college, if you didn't know. Uh, there's a reason why he got drafted so because the, the man was a marvel in college football. Another st outstanding pass. I believe that's Jabari Gaffney or Jabari Gaffney. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Anyways, man, back to this. This, again, was just really Madden 2001 dressed in college football because in Madden 2001, guys were in elbow pads like crazy. Another perfect pass by Rex Grossman. And in Madden 2002, they really didn't wear those same elbow pads. I don't know why they had that in Madden 2001 to begin with. But, no, again, I'm not complaining, and I wasn't complaining back then. It was just looking back on it. It's just kind of weird when you think about it. And look at that pass. My boy Rex Grossman out there slinging it. Rex Grossman can fight that rock now. He could throw that pill. Know what I'm saying? Throw that pill and put it right in your mouth. Anyways, man, my boy Rex Grossman, he out there balling. Now it's Ken Dorsey's time. Miami, they in trouble. They're the number two team in the nation. Florida, they're the number one team in the nation. That's why I did this matchup. I also wanted to see Rex Grossman fighting that rock because I was like, who's a quarterback that I haven't played with in, in, in like a while? I haven't talked about it in a while. It's Rex Grossman. He, he was an animal. So is Ken Dorsey. Ken Dorsey, all he did was win national championships, it seemed like, in college. At least get there. At least get there. And the U, they put up a touchdown right there, but it's too little, too late. They're going to end up dropping this game. There's only 53 seconds on the clock. Rex Grossman, he was doing his thing, man. But NCAA 2002, as far as game modes, you had practice, had ex exhibition, you had season mode, and you had dynasty. And that was about it. That, that was about it. There was no Road to Glory yet. There was no Campus Legend yet. The Dynasty feature did not have, you know, the ESPN Magazine, Sports Illustrated Magazine. Did not have in-season recruiting. So, again, it was a good game for when it came out. But looking back on it, I guess it didn't age too well. <laughs> but you don't expect these games back then to age that well. Even though there were some classics back in this year on the PS2. But I'm gone. I'll see y'all next time. Peace, love. Hot sauce.